Um, in this in this video clip, um, I'm going to discuss question four two in the October 2014 exam paper. The question reads as follows: Explain using a Keynesian model of the economy why the decrease in economic activity in Europe had a negative effect on the level of employment in South Africa. Now, to be able to answer this question, you need to focus on two things. First of all, how the decrease in economic activity affected Europe. And secondly, how the decrease in economic activity in Europe affected South Africa. So, with a decrease in economic activity in Europe, this essentially affects Europe's ability to import goods. So, if there is a decrease in economic activity, you therefore expect to find a, a decrease in Europe's ability to import goods. Now, if South Africa is a trading partner of Europe, you then expect, therefore, that a decrease in Europe's import essentially means a decrease in South African exports to Europe. Okay? So in terms of, of the impact of a reduction in economic activity in Europe in South Africa, the reduction in European imports translates to a reduction in South, South African exports because South Africa is a trading partner to Europe. Now, when there is a reduction in exports, we therefore expect that aggregate demand will decrease. Because aggregate demand is composed of net exports. So a reduction in net exports means a reduction in aggregate demand. Now, when aggregate demand decreases, that means that production in South, Af in South Africa will also decrease um, because producers will no longer be able to produce as much as they used to produce. So you expect a reduction in production. Now, when production reduces, it therefore means that producers do not require as much um, employees as they used to, and so you expect that employment will also reduce. And when employment reduces, that means that income will therefore also fall. So now I'm going to explain to you how the marks were allocated for this question. If you explain that the, the impact of a, a decrease in economic activity in Europe is first a decrease in European imports, that is one mark. And then if you further explain that the decrease in European imports translates to a decrease in South African exports to Europe, that is one mark. That reduction in South African exports means that there's going to be a reduction in aggregate demand in South Africa. That is one mark. And that reduction in aggregate demand translates to a reduction in production as well as a reduction in employment. That is one mark. And that reduction in employment means that there's going to be a reduction in income. And that's one mark. So the mark, the, the question was five marks.